Hey there, it's Eric Evanstead at bootstrapbizgrowth.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to electronically sign documents or client contracts using a tool called HelloSign. And HelloSign is a free tool um, up to three contracts per month so it is a little bit limited if you want to get more contracts signed each month then you will have to pay but it's still a really cheap tool. So this is one that I love and I've been using it for years. I've used it in my web design business. Whenever I'm starting out with a new client, I'll have them sign my contract and I'll send it to them using HelloSign and they can go through, read it, initial it in spots, sign it at the end, date it. And this just makes it a lot easier than faxing or sending it uh, via mail or uh, meeting in person. It just makes it very convenient and easy for everybody involved to sign these contracts and get projects moving faster. So I'm gonna pull up my screen here and I'm gonna show you how to get started with HelloSign and just kind of show you around and show you a few features that I really love. Um, and hopefully by the end of it, you're going to be up and running and you're going to be using it yourself. So let's pull it up here. Here we are at HelloSign on their homepage. What you're going to do is you're just going to go to pricing or you can try it for free, but um, just to show you their pricing model, they have a free plan, which is what I use. Um, that just works fine for me because I only need about three documents signed per month. If you need more, just sign up for their pro plan for 13 bucks a month, super cheap still. Um, another benefit of the pro plan is that you can upload templates. So if you have, you know, say again for my web design company, I have a basic contract for any client that I bring on for web design work. I could upload that and that's just going to make it very easy and fast to get that contract out to people in the future. Um, otherwise, you'll just have to upload it each time, which isn't a big deal. Uh, it really doesn't bother me. It takes just another minute or so. So I'm going to show you into my account um, and I just have the free plan because that's what I'm kind of recommending most people get started with. Um, so I'll show you what it looks like inside. So when you first get started, it's going to ask you who needs to sign this document. So it could be just you, it could be other people, or it could be you and other people. So typically it's going to be this one, you and other people. Um, so I'm going to click on that. And now I want to upload my contract so I can upload a word document. I can upload from Google drive. So a Google doc, um, a PDF, uh, the list goes on. It really doesn't matter. You can upload any type of document that you want, um, that has, you know, your contract on it. So for this example, I'm going to upload my website contract to do that. I'm going to click upload files, and then I'm just going to browse for it on my computer hit open and now it is adding that file into hello sign so that we can uh, mark where it needs to be signed and send it out to the appropriate people. Okay. So as you can see, it's done uploading now into hello sign. And so what we want to do now is we want to mark who needs to sign it. So you want to put your name first. Um, so your full name and then your email address and then whoever else is going to be signing it. You want to put their info in as well. Um, I'm just going to put my name again in here and use a different email address just so you can see what it looks like. But obviously you would want to use your client's name and you can add multiple people in here if you would like, if you would like. Um, and then you want to assign the signer order. So I always sign it first. I want to send my clients a signed copy. So all they have to do is sign it and they're done. So that's what I do. If you want to switch it up, you can, uh, but we'll leave it this way. Then you want to come down here and you want to click prepare docs for signing. And this is pretty easy here. Um, what you want to do though, is you want to just drag these down where they need to sign. So for client signature, I would drag this over here. Actually, this would be for designer signature because this is first. I'll put that right there. Who signs here? Eric Evans said that was me. We'll make that required. That looks good. And then we'll drag another one down here. And we're going to change this to the second one. So this would be the client also required. And then we could do print designer name. So again, this will be We'll change the label option to print name. Okay, that looks good. 
We'll do that again. Okay, and then we'll do some dates right in there. Okay, so that's looking good. And then maybe if we had like an important clause in your contract, uh, so right here would be where I have my payment information and the cost of the website. I might do an initial there and you could select who, who does that. So that would probably be the client's initial. And then once it's all done, we'll, we're going to hit continue and the document is prepared. And so what we want to do here is name the document. So website contract for client name, we might call that. And here's the contract. Please read and sign. And we'll do a request signature. So it says we'll keep you updated on its status. Okay, so now I can go into documents. And I can see this contract. So right here it says awaiting my signature. So what that means is I'm going to have to go into my email account and sign it. Okay, so I'll pull that up right now. I'm just going to drag my email over so you can see it. Um, here's the email from HelloSign. So I'm going to click review and sign. It's going to pull up this contract. So that's the one we just uploaded. And then I'm going to scroll all the way down. Click to sign. And I can select a signature that I want to sign with. So we'll just do that first one. I'll hit insert. Um, another thing too is if you want to, you can draw it in as well or upload an image if you have a picture of your signature. Um, but we'll just do that, the one that we did before. Uh, print designer name. So I'm going to type out my name. It automatically dates it on the date that I sign it. So I'm just going to come up here and hit continue. I agree to be legally bound by this document. Um, so I'm going to hit agree. And I'll exit out of that. So if I refresh this page back in that document section, it'll say out for signature. So that means that I've signed it and now it's been emailed out to the client for them to sign. So I'll pull up my other email address here. And this is the one I was using as the client email address. So right in here should have it. So website contract for client name. So this would be the email that the client is getting. And so they're going to be asked to review and sign as well. Hit get started. So it's going to ask me to initial because we set that up. So we'll do that insert. And down here, you can see that first signature is already there. All that info is here. So the client would just come in here insert their signature, type out their name, hit next, hit I agree, and we are all set. So now if I go back into here and refresh that page, now it says completed. So we are all good to go. And what it's going to do is it's going to send out a copy of this signed document to both parties or to all parties. So the client's going to get a signed copy and you are going to get a signed copy so that everybody has it. There's no confusion. You don't have to worry about going in and sending PDFs manually. It's just all done automatically. So that's another thing that I really love about HelloSign. And as you can see, it's just super simple to come in here, create these contracts, send them out, get everybody's signatures, and it just moves really seamlessly um, for everybody involved. And, uh, and that's why I love it. It saves so much time when you're working with clients or you need um, some sort of signature on a document. This is really a lifesaver tool and one that I definitely recommend for all entrepreneurs, but especially those that work with clients and have signed contracts with um, the people that they work with. So definitely sign up for HelloSign. 
If you have any questions for me, feel free to drop a message down below. I'd be happy to help as best as I can. And I would love it if you would subscribe to the YouTube channel here. We're all about helping you grow your business on a budget. So we talk about all kinds of helpful, cheap, or free tools like this. It's gonna help make your life easier as an entrepreneur. We talk about affordable marketing strategies that actually work. We talk about outsourcing. So again, the general theme is how to grow your business on a budget. That's the type of topic that we cover on this YouTube channel, so please subscribe. And lastly, I just want to thank you for coming by and checking out this video. I hope it was helpful, and we'll see you next time.